Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, I wasn't able to go out and make the videos I was wanting to make this week because we're having just extreme cold and getting hammered with snow just like most of the country is right now. But, you know, I wanted to just sit here real quick, make a quick video and let you know where we're at in the process of starting the gun shop. Um, that was kind of, you know, the whole reason of starting this channel was to walk through the process of what it is to start a shop, but it's already turned into so much more and we appreciate everybody that's already liked and subscribed. But so far, Sue Monday Arms is a LLC business. Um, we got all of our paperwork back for that, our certificate from the state. Um, right now we're going through and figuring out what all taxes we need to get, tax numbers and stuff like that, state and federal and everything. And uh, as soon as we get all that back, we'll be able to finish up our application with the city. Um, we were uh, we got in contact with the guy that's going to be doing the taxes for the company, and he was awesome and uh, helped us out figure out what all we needed, what we're exempt from, and this and that. So that was very helpful. If you're looking into doing this, I highly suggest you find the a tax person and uh, help have them help you figure out what all you need in your state and in your area. We also reached out to a guy in the area. His name's Cameron. He work, he owns a Rune Raven. He does amazing custom work, stippling and things of that nature so if you ever need anything hit him up but he was awesome enough to just kind of walk me through the process and what all it takes to get to the point that you can fill out your ffl because you know the first day i was ready to fill out my ffl paperwork and send it off and he saved me a lot of headache and uh trying to figure out what was going on by letting me know that i had to get your llc all your tax stuff and your city permit back or your business license back from the city before you can ever fill out and send off for that ffl paperwork so that was super helpful and i really appreciate him helping me out with that but you know we're really looking forward to where this channel's going um we got some really cool stuff coming up where you know we've been in contact with some different companies that are going to be sending us some products to test and review on here and uh, with that we're building kind of a channel a r15 that uh, we're going to be able to put all the products on and test them on one platform and really put them head to head and see what you know all these products that these companies are sending to us but hey, we got some cool stuff coming for that ar15 that we're waiting to get in as soon as we do we'll be sharing that with you on here we're really excited about that but um, if you haven't watched the video the last video where we put the CV life scope on the 6.5 Grindel go back and watch that video because we're going to be taking that Grindel out here soon and doing some really cool coyote hunts with some friends of ours and um, we've also got some really cool trips planned for you know early spring and midsummer and maybe even one in the fall for doing some fishing and hunting trips out west so we're really looking forward to that really excited about what that is all going to be but uh if you're interested in that kind of thing i hope that you'll go ahead and subscribe if you already subscribed thank you so much thank you guys